I don't know where to start. There's so much I want to do because it's toy day. I've been working on my town all year. I've 460 hours in this game. It's one of the most played games I think I've ever owned. Uh, it's like shock horror. I have looked after my island. I know some people on the channel are so used to seeing me cannibalize and destroy every single set of game systems I come into contact with, but no. Animal Crossing is serious shit. I don't know where to start the tour, but I guess one good thing to note might be this little flower sanctuary that's here. Here's the blue rose shine, here's the perfect flowers, Jacob's ladders all decorated around it. Here's blue, blue pansy valley. Go up to the campsite. I've got cosmos. Every single kind. Every single hybrid. I've got my own little, like, kind of telescope spot. It's really sweet. Eggtown is back. It's got a crispy take. I've got hybrid hycanets hi everywhere. Here's another blue valley. We got a Christmas tree island. It's Blue Bear's house. She's chilling there. We've still got our little, like, kind of mountain shrine up here. One of the first things to build in this town. It's looking as cute as ever. I love it. It's my favorite spot in the entire town. I've got every kind of hybrid tulip. Uh, on the, my own private island in my town. I've disconnected myself from the mainland. I've done up my plantation. Uh, I've got all my pink roses. I organized my flowers. I now have every train set in the game. We got pumpkins here. At the end of this, we have every piece of furniture from the Thanksgiving holiday in the game. We did out our own little dinner and cafe spot. We got a secret beach spot over here. You can cut through the orchard. We got the bamboo garden. It's all looking nice. I've got flowers everywhere around here. This is right next to the town hall. And I have organized every single hybrid in this town. We've got Christmas decorations about Santa, about Jingle. I'll get back to you soon. We've got a little garden in here. We found the Statue of Liberty. We've stolen it. I've got my lighthouse done up here with like all the hybrid flowers again. I've done up a little soccer field over here. Uh, this is Anka's private raised island that we have. Anka now lives here and she's one of like the staple villagers of the community. She has her own little like kind of raised cliff. How does such a chaotic man create such beauty? That's the thing. This is like, this is the one game that no matter how much time I spend with, I cannot do bad. Yeah, yeah, everything else, I'll fuck it up somehow. Animal Crossing, it's not possible because I love this game too much. We got every single holiday related item uh, in relation to Christmas. This is a Christmas tree. This kind of a deer. There's the illuminated present. Every single item of snowman furniture is crash landed here. I didn't know where to put the bed. It's just here. It's outside. Merry Christmas. Have a sleep in the snow. Don't die of hypothermia. With the frozen tree here, you can kind of see the flower sanctuary up there. We got a little wedding bench tucked over there. Every hybrid organized again. I even got the. Be I found the bean bag. From the f original island that we played Animal Crossing on, like, uh, like the one that I deleted, uh, it's back, and it's in the Blue Rose Garden. I like to call these the Battenberg flowers because that's what the colors remind me of. We got my own little gym. <laughs> it's got a pool and like just punching bags. We got like Spooksburg. Here's all the Halloween furniture in the game. That's all just here. Villager Wise as well. There's so many like dream villagers that are now living in the town. We've got Anka. We've got Hopper. Fushka. Uh, we've got Eric, we've got O'Hare, Vesta, we got Mint the Squirrel just as of yesterday, my favorite squirrel villager in the game. I'm very happy that she's joined the town. We got Blue Bear, we got Rene, we've got Ken as well. I don't like Ken, he's probably gonna move at some point. We've got an established road network all across the town. I paved every single one of these roads so I could decorate it. We also have this part of the town, and I should explain what's going on here. Uh, this is the wall. Um, to get the festive recipes, um, in th th my game, I had to find a way to trap flying presents. And what I did is I walled off the entire right side of my island. <laughs> and what this does is when a flying present comes in, it hits the wall, and it gets funneled all the way down to the bottom. So what I did, and this took about, like, 20 hours of in-game time, uh, I stood here and checked the game every 10 minutes for 20 hours. And because of that, I was able to get every single festive recipe in the game. Uh, it took fucking forever to do this one. That's not it as well. Uh, I I've, I've got even more to show because we didn't stop there. I have caught every single bug in the game and donated them all to the museum. 
I have caught every single fish in the game and donated them all to the museum. I have caught almost every sea creature in the game bar two. The reason I haven't been able to get these two is because they only become available in March. Come March, I will complete that. Uh, and then the one other thing that I have been doing, and this one is this one is, is taking a lot of time as well. It's not finished. No, some of you are probably thinking, <laughs> like, no way. No, I haven't been able to get all the art. But I have been able to get a lot of it. The art in this game, collecting it, it is, is horrific. Red only likes to show up to your town like once or twice a month. But, with that said, I've been able to get a fair amount to get as much done as I can. How do you pronounce Fushka, by the way? How do you actually pronounce that? Because people were laughing at me earlier. Yusha. Okay, thank you. I've pronounced that wrong all my life. No one has ever corrected me. Uh, this is my home as well. I have taken the time to decorate this. Just with a large assortment of items. Basically, through the year. Have you gotten any photographs yet? No. Um... So it turns out, because you get a, a picture of your animal villagers if you become their best friend. I've spent so much time in this game doing everything else that I actually forget to talk to my villagers uh, pretty much every day. And I think the greatest su summation of this is the island togetherness nook mile. The goal of this is simply to talk to your villagers every day. Since March, I have only achieved this nine days of the year. <laughs> And I would like to stress, I have played this game literally every day this year. <laughs> and I have not accomplished this. <laughs> He's a hermit, basically. <laughs> like, I just, like, run past them. The most I've talked to villagers is when one of them tells me they're moving away and leaving my town. Oh, here's my little bathroom as well. I, I quite like this room. I like how that spotlight lines up with the fish eye. Uh, here's an, a duplicate copy of Vincent van Gogh's, uh, like, Starry Night too. Uh, the museum didn't want this one, so, you know, I've just put it next to my bathtub. Uh, here is my upstairs room, and I've even done out my own little recording studio in here. Oh, this is, this is my gamer streamer setup. Downstairs is the one room that has, uh, just not been worked on at all in any capacity. Uh, formerly, this used to just be a teddy bear prison. But I actually have to use the jail bars to block off the right half of my entire island. So the bars are gone. Presumably this means the bears are free. But I will box them in and re-imprison re them at some point in time. Uh, oh, and the other thing I've got as well. Uh, I've got an ice wand that I made. And I've got the outfits that we've come to know and love through, the year, through this year of playing Animal Crossing. I can cast my naked spell. We have egg. We have buff. Uh, we just have this galaxy hoodie. That I just like to wear, wear sometimes. There's no meme here. And then for today, we got a Christmas outfit. And there we go. That's that's my town. Let's go talk the jingle. Ho ho ho! Happy holidays. I'm Jingle the Black-Nosed Reindeer. This is the most special and exciting time of the year, isn't it? And today is the most exciting day of all. It's Toy Day. And I've got the very best job I can think of in the whole world. I get to help Santa deliver presents. So ho ho, how's your Toy Day going so far? Hope it's as merry as it can be. Normally I would crucify the villagers for making um, really in your face puns. But as today is a holiday, uh, I will suppress my murderous tendencies. Oh, I have presents big and small, perfectly tailored by the big guy for everyone on the island. What's the use if they aren't wrapped in festive paper? Can one even feel joy without festive paper? Here's the recipe. This will be great. Just craft a little wrapping paper and we'll pretend this didn't happen. Which I gotta think about that for a moment. Imagine Santa, like, on the day was like, Oh, no! I ra I missing a single, like, uh, uh, just a roll of wrapping paper. Well, I guess Christmas is cancelled. Yesterday's newspaper to the rescue. <laughs> it's like, oh, Jingle, I think I have, like, a gift bag from last year. Could you use that? I think we got, like, those ones just chilling there. They got their own little space. I've kind of used them as, like, just statues about the time. Wait, was there a tarantula? <laughs> Thank you very much, and here's a little something for you. A set of Toy Day stockings. How would you like to help me deliver Toy Day presents? No time to question it. Here, you'll need one of these. It's a sack. 
That's a magic bag. It's filled with gifts for each and every resident of this island. It's magical, see? Don't worry about my deliveries. I'm happy to share. I know Toy Doy. Toy, 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 Toy Day is in great hands. Jesus. <laughs> toy Doy? Uh, where is the tarantula? Merry Christmas, we're going tarantula hunting. Okay, keep an eye out if you see another tarantula in our town. <laughs> like, there's a hazard at work today. Like, you gotta be careful delivering the presents. Oh, Anka, are you alright? Do you want me to come back? Like, are you... you just hopped on the loo. Ah, Daniel, let me get up. <laughs> let me just finish real quick. Oh, <laughs> Uh, you might want to open a window in here, Anka. Uh. <laughs> Daniel, whatever are you doing with that large bag, me meow? Uh, I have a gift for you. It's toilet paper. When you're done helping out Santa, would you come back and see me again? I have a small token of my affection for you in honor of the season. Okay, I'll come. Okay, she needs the poop again. I'm, I'm going. I'm going. She's uh <laughs> going for round two. That can't be healthy. <laughs> What's with the bag? I'd get it if you were doing a Santa thing, but you're not, so what gives? I'm here to rob you, Rene. <laughs> Merry Christmas. The bag you're carrying around is suspiciously huge, amigo. What's in it? Get in the bag. Oh, look, Eric's like meeting his hero. It's two reindeer. Oh, wait, no, Eric, walk back there. We need to get a picture. Eric, stop walking away from the camera. Eric, you just gotta turn around. <laughs> That'll do. That'll do. It's his long lost father. <laughs> it's like, Dad? Dad, where have you been? I haven't seen you since last Christmas. Man, helping out Santa is a big deal. I want to give you something. Oh. Thank you for helping Santa, and thank you for being my friend. Oh. You're my new hero, darling. You've saved Toy Do to Why does this keep happening? Toy Doy. For us all. For some reason, Vesta's home has just been transformed into a laundromat over time. Uh, and I'm not really sure why. But, like, apparently, like, she doesn't even have a bed. Like, she's just a dry cleaning service. What you got in the bag, kiddo? You find some of Santa's old laundry? <laughs> yeah, here's his underwear, Hopper. Happy toy doy. You're the lucky one who gets to help deliver gifts. That is Trey Awesome Lucky. Yeah, coincidentally, like, the nickname they've all taken the call on me lately is Lucky, so... Wow, you're Lucky, Lucky! Why aren't you going down the chimneys, you pose? <laughs> okay, just- just sit tight, Blue Bear! I will be in soon! <laughs> uh, we're gonna have to widen the chimney! Wait, no joke, you actually have a present for me from Santa? I was half kidding, but I'm not gonna say no. I have to return the favor next year, precious. She didn't get me anything. And we know we are done because the island togetherness nook mile achievement has updated. <laughs> Maybe like by the end of 2021 I can get that to 20 out of 20. Uh, but that might be quite ambitious. You're all done. Each and every present is exactly where it should be. I'm so thankful I could share the magic of Toy Doy. Damn it, I didn't even mean to do it there. But it's not just all talk. I have gifts for you. First up is a little recipe that I think will make things even more festive around here. Oh, what are we gonna get? And then, something extra special. Your very own Toy Day sleigh. Oh. Oh. You help make Toy Doy- to Fuck! Toy Day! Extra magical. <laughs> For everyone living on the tally, you know that? And also, Yo, I've got a Christmas present for you, too. It's a test to see if you have a speech impediment, because Jesus, you seem to be having some trouble there, Daniel. Maybe we'll run into each other again on some far-off toy day in the future. See you later, kid. Gift pile. And we have the sleigh as well. I mean, right here seems like a good spot for the sleigh. Pop it down. Oh my... God, I love it. Wait, let's exchange gifts. I don't I don't have anything on my I don't have anything on my inventory. Hang on. Uh what what presents can I get people? This is last minute shopping for Christmas. Uh they don't have much in the store. Uh, I can get th the radio is blue. That okay, this is blue bear sort it. Oh god, it's like we're trying to do Christmas shopping in the gas station because like we we've messed up on Christmas Eve. Uh so let's uh get crafting these. 
<laughs> I just hope they don't compare Christmas presents because then they'll realize that I got them all the same thing. I can actually, if I just make candles for the other ones. Daniel, they are virtual animals and sweaters. I don't care what you give them for Christmas, but I care what I give them for Christmas. This is their Christmas too. I need to make sure it's nice for them. You know, even though I completely forgot to buy him presents for the 24 days of time I've had. The villagers want toys since it's toy day. But no, they're gonna get candles. They'll love it. Oh, I love it. The gift pile. I wish it could be toy day every day. Although, I guess that would make it less special. That is an episode of the Fairly Odd Parents where they try that. Uh, it's a nightmarish hellscape by the end. Feels nice and hefty. Better brace yourself because I don't hold back when I tear into a present. Whoa, you gotta be kidding me! A candle? Pretty fancy, pal. You got me good. This is one gift I'm gonna take real good care of. Well, it's a candle, you know? You're not... You're just supposed to just light it and you know, it'll be a nice evening. I'm gonna give her an ornament just because she has some really cool furniture in her house. And I would hate her to just like throw out the pyramid to put a candle in her home. I'm so happy with the road network I've set up too. Like this took so long to do some of it. Basically, I try- Are you? Uh, I'll talk about the road network in a moment. Hang on. Oh no, I can't do it that way. Oh, fuck! Oh, oh, oh! No, 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 no! <laughs> uh, okay, who's next on the list for Christmas presents? Uh, Vesta! Vesta! How you doing? Yeah, I, I got something for you! <laughs> oh, God. How you doing, Vesta? Vesta? You know, I'm gonna advise you to just take a chill night indoors. Um, there's, there's no point in going outside. Oh fuck, she's already got the- That's the gift I was gonna give her! Hey, uh, Blue Bear, um... You know, I got you- I got you these ornaments. Yo, this is an Animal Crossing Nintendo Switch, right? Don't answer, you are a swag legend. <laughs> for giving me something so valuable. Yeah, these things are like gold dust on eBay. There you go. That's all the presents delivered. Yeah, like over the course of this year though, like this has probably been my single most played game. Um, if you have to ask me what like a game of the year I would choose is... It is undoubtedly this one. Because it... it just with, with the year it has been... This game has been like the constant in my life that's just kind of kept me grounded. And just provided a bit of joy each day. So I love all the Animal Crossing games. But this one, like, like, even though it's only been a year, I've got a lot of sentiment, um, you know, tied to it. And, and you know, I have a lot of memories from playing this game, too. We could go tarantula hunting. You wanna try catch one of the buggers? I still have some, like, Nook Mile tickets if we wanna try, um, go island hopping. You really wanna do that for Christmas? I mean, we might as well. When we started playing this game, like this year, one of the first things we did was Tarantula Island. Yeah, let's get a Christmas Tarantula. Okay, I guess we're just gonna... It's Tarantula Island! Oh, holy shit, we actually got it! We've come full circle! We don't need to make it ourselves! Oh, there's so many Tarantulas. Okay, let's, let's start catching them. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I gotta drop as much stuff as I can to carry just like precious, precious tarantulas. I just wish they weren't so clumped together. No, cuz- <laughs> like, A different tarantula killed me there. Come on! I can kite kind him, of, I can still get him. Oh! <laughs> There we go. I think we've got enough tarantulas. <laughs> okay, Merry Christmas, Ken. Uh, I hope the new year is full of surprises for you.